My name is Mary Jackson, and I've been a member of the Sharks and Minnows Childhood Gaming League for around 10 years. I tried to get a team started when I first came to school, but the ASU never approved it. But I think this is going to be our year. Oh my god, Jesus, you scared me. My name's not Jesus, it's Steve. We've met before, asshole. Mr. President, did you get a chance to look at our application? Uh, yeah, okay, I looked over it, and uh, I'm just not really convinced childhood games should be in club sports this year. Huh. Child, childish. He thinks we're childish. He thinks what we do is childish. Okay. okay, I didn't mean it like that. Um, Mary, Mary, please, please don't cry again. I'm not. Uh, do you guys want to just talk about this in my office? Yes. No. Steve, come on, let's go. Come on. Yes, let's go. Basically, Mary has been filing petitions every year to get her team instated. Uh, Steve, you want to take a seat? No. Okay. Yeah. So, look, like I said earlier, there's $280 that comes out of student tuition to go to student activities. And I'm just not convinced right now that it should be taken away from important things like assault prevention shuttle. I voted for you, okay? And you can't even do your job. Look, this isn't even my job. This is Maddie's back in club sports and she's out again with mad cow disease, which doesn't even make sense because she's a vegetarian. Wait, Maddie Lungsford? Uh, yeah. Oh no. Maddie has mad cow? Yeah, I mean, yeah, apparently. Wait, Maddie has been having sex? With cows? God! Oh, Sorry, did she use protection? I need to air out my penis. Steve, oh God, I'm we have to get you tested. Oh, no, no, oh, oh my gosh. Wait, look at me, wait, look at me. Oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. Can I... stop. Okay, look, I'm going to give you guys the same deal I gave the Quidditch guys, okay? If you can show there's enough talent on campus, enough interest, and you guys can place at the end of the term at regionals, then yeah, okay, I'll give you a shot. Okay. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. Thank you so much. Um, black, black, no trades back. Yeah, whatever. Okay. And uh, you won't regret this. Uh huh. So. Yeah, all right. You can let okay. go. Yeah. So. Uh -huh. After the Quidditch team lost all their brooms in that terrible fire, uh, we had no choice but to accept her request. So the ASU president said we had to get a third co captain, and luckily we found Ellen. She's a little quiet, but she's pretty great. My parents said I either had to join a club sport or join a sorority. I hate girls. Well guys, any minute, hordes of students are going to be pouring through that door because they've been waiting for a team like this. Yeah, you know, I just want to make clear, I don't want any noobs, no greenhorns, okay? This is professional. This, these are tryouts. If they don't try, then they're out in the snow. That's, I could not in agree the ice, more. That's, that's fine. Falling on their ass. You guys should probably just take whoever you can get. You know, Ellen, that's a good point because inclusivity is what Sharks and Minnows is about. I don't know what that means. That means that anyone can play. Still not. Let's get it over with. You know, that's a good point. I will go open the door and let's let's get auditions going. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Welcome. So we wanted to hold auditions in a gym, but the ACO wouldn't pay for it. Uh, so we were going to use an open court over at the library, and then the snowstorm hit. But now we're holding auditions in my kitchen. All right, Scrubs, I know this isn't new information to any of you, but Mary here wanted to go over the rules of the game one more time. So here I am. As you know, the tournament consists of two teams competing. The judge will select the games to be played, and in true rock, paper, scissors fashion, best two out of three wins it. Today we will be judging you on agility, strength, strategy, and integrity. Whatever that means. So, good luck, Scrubs, because you're going to need it. I was an A sport varsity athlete and I'm currently a Rhodes Scholar. This morning at 4 a.m. I got back from Borneo inoculating baby dolphins. The women won me, and so do you. I'm not a huge fan of physical activity or sweat or people sweating or being around people who are sweating, um, but I'll do it as long as there's no drug test. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really glad you guys are making this new club. Kind of burned some bridges with the other clubs. <laughs> so this is really fun, new opportunity that I'm excited for. 
I was uh, homeschooled my entire life. Uh, this is actually the most people I've ever been around. Simon says, touch your head. Simon says, touch your nose. Touch your mouth. Nice try, homeschool. Out. I'm just trying to make friends. Are, are you guys friends? All right, well, first of all, we'd like to thank all of you for coming. It means a lot that you all showed up today. So what's going to happen is uh, I'm going to call your name, and if you hear it, then that means you made the team. So uh, here we go. Uh, Robin. That's it? Yeah, that's it. What the fuck? Are you serious? Just him. Can I go now, or...? Yeah, you, you can go. Please, please leave. Please, all of you should leave. I mean, that kid made sense, but all of us? Oh my god. Whatever. I got a Learjet waiting. Wheels up at 15. Alright, so Robin. Welcome! Congratulations! Robin, welcome to the team. We are so excited to have you. We're this not. just could not have worked out better for everyone. Um, I think we're all really thrilled nice. that you made it, and we can't wait to get started. You really made the big leagues. Yeah, we didn't really have much to choose from, so I guess we had to do but what... Uh... Oh my... Oh. You've been hiding in there the whole time? We could use a hider like you. Welcome, welcome to the team. What's uh, your name? Oh, I'm well, not sure. well, welcome, Phil. We are so excited to have you. What do I think about Phil coming out of the closet? I think it's pretty hot. We got a pretty good turnout, and I think with a few practices, we could be ready to take regionals. And how are you guys planning on raising the funds for regionals? Oh, I think ASUO will cover that. No, they're not. I think they will. No, really. Well, I guess we'll just have to agree to disagree. Yeah, definitely disagree. 